Hello and welcome to another devlog for Peasant Uprise. If you're new to the channel, Peasant Uprise is a game that aims to present a unique experience that blends RPG and strategy elements, led by a group of simple peasants. There is nothing more epic in RPG games than boss fights. They bring something more than just a tough challenge. They require some preparation, an extra consideration, and they normally also expose new mechanics that the player will have to conquer. Now, in fantasy games, these fights seem a bit more epic considering you can fight massive dragons or really ugly creatures. But despite the fact that Peasant Uprise is not a fantasy game, I did want to have some special villains that would introduce a different kind of challenge. I do not want to go over every boss or their abilities, but I will use the Heavy Soldier as an example. Each boss fight will count with two special abilities at least. One to enhance the fighting alongside the boss and another one that is applied to the boss itself. In this particular case, every enemy soldier will have a defense buff. And when it comes to the boss, he will execute a special move called Ground Blast that will stun every peasant in combat. To add to the challenge, the Heavy Soldier will use this ability several times throughout the fight, making it a longer encounter than usual. Will your peasants be able to stay on their feet? Or will your tactics improve your odds? I'm especially keen on Zion, because she's a boss that ties to the faction's premise and questline. Being an alchemist, she'll have a few tricks up her sleeves. The addition of bosses goes hand in hand with making each level special in its own way. Some are special because of the resources they offer or lack, some are special because they are towns or because they host a particular faction. Now, bosses will be the focus of some of the later levels in the game, and again, something to look for as the player advances through the game. As you can see in the map, these are the levels that have been completed, leaving only 5 levels left. And this will be the focus of the second test phase, which I know I have delayed a bit since I was in a good pace building up levels, but it should be coming up shortly. If you like my content, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click on the bell to receive notifications. And if you're interested in Peasant Uprise, you can go ahead and wishlist it in Steam. With that said, I'll see you in the next update.